Hunger Games short movie review. In an alternate reality or a not too distant future, this has a capital where the very rich and powerful live, the ones running everything, and everything else is divided into districts, 12 districts, with the 12th being the poorest. Every year, two people, young people, aged I think 12 to 18 or something, have to participate in the so-called Hunger Games, where they have to kill each other, excuse me, until only one is alive. And, excuse me, this is about one specific year where Katniss Everdeen takes her sister's place and, yeah, competes and, you know, hopes that she can somehow win. But she was mostly just, you know, sacrificing herself so that her sister could, you know, wouldn't have to go into the Hunger Games where she would be a lamb to the slaughter. This is a great adaptation and a great film. The it's it's well filmed, well directed, well edited. The only aspect where the filming is not quite that good is in the action sequences themselves where the camera tends to be too close and far too shaky for, you know, you you can't particularly tell what's going on. It's disorienting, and it tends not to call for that, really. There are a couple of bits where that actually works, but when it's just two people fighting each other, there's no reason for it to be that disorienting. The Most of the changes from the book, you know, either go over well or are at least, you know, quite forgivable. There's really only one major change that I think is really hurting it, but on the whole it is a really great adaptation. The characters are there and they, you know, they come off as they should. Cato is vicious. Caesar you just love from the second you see him. You know, Effie is eccentric. The people from the capital are very grotesque in appearance with, you know, makeup, color choices, clothing. The wish fulfillment aspect of the book is somewhat present and it's, you know, as satisfying and, you know, really not, as it is in the book. The, the film is quite tense and it wisely spends about half the film building up the Hunger Games and establishing character and situation before the actual competition begins. One aspect that was sadly lost in adapting this is the pure survival of, you know, just surviving in the, you know, in the arena kind of aspect from the book where you know, just finding food and water is, you know, difficult enough that, you know, it might not even be the other, you know, young people that kill you. It might just be, yeah, the environment. But yes, it's, it's a very well-paced film and quite exciting, you know, even though it spends half the film without, you know, without the straight competition, there's still stuff going on, and you're never bored. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below, it's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.